It's time for Dodger Baseball. This series can't get any better. Well, it's a cold night in Seattle, but at the very least, the roof will be shut to shield us from some of that. Tonight, it's the home opener for this new season between the Oakland A's and the Seattle Mariners. It's Mariners baseball, and it comes your way next. Now at the plate, Marcus Semyon. He'll get us started in this one the under the lights. Shortstop. Number 10. Swinging on the first pitch here as Uffet came back and caught the catcher flush on the mask that time. Ouch. 
And HR, you take a look at these Seattle Mariners entering play here tonight. They come in winners of three in a row and riding a nice little run to start the new series. Well, Matt, I really like the pitching staff, but I think the key to this game is clearly falls on their shoulders. They throw off speed pitches for strikes and they mix the pitch as well. I think if they do that, they got a chance to win. And now look out as Ed runs in and gets him, and a very interesting start to this one. Batting second here tonight. The first baseman, first baseman. Eric Hosmer, is Eric in. Hosmer. And a quick glance at the numbers. We'll tell you it's been a huge struggle for him at the plate this year. Here's a sinker to start him out, but he wouldn't bite. It's ball one. Here comes the 1 0. Sinker stayed high, but called for a strike. Oh, that's for sure going to be a pitch he wants back. You're not going to get many balls right in the wheelhouse from a top level arm like this. And he'll snap one over to first. A sinker over the outside corner for strike two. Well, now it's a one-two count. He's throwing the same pitch three times in a row. He got ahead with it. Now let's see if he puts him away with it. And that's going to be high two and two now. That one missed, but if it's a strike, I don't know how you get the barrel of that pitch. You have to really be sitting on it to hit a fastball coming in that hard on the inside part of the plate. And the sinking fastball called strike three, and that's out number one. Well, left fielder number two. Chris Here's the first Davis. pitch to him. Chris Davis comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1 and 0. Boy, that's a great breaking ball right there. That's a tough pitch to lay off when that ball is coming in at that plane right there. Quality take. Now a swing, and he just fouls this one away. Here's a look over to first. Runner at first here, one man out. No contact there, and it's one and two. Well, that's a true indicator he's looking for a fastball in. He wanted to spin the win right there, knock one as far as he could. He got the off speed pitch inside, and he pulled off of it. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Ready with the two and two. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. The two two one more time. Chopped weakly to the left. Reined in. And indeed, no look at second. He'll go straight to first and take the shoe out. So stepping in, Matt Chapman. First opportunity for him here with the leadoff man still standing at second. Two gone now. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Thought he had the inside corner that time, but it missed for ball one. Ready with the 1 0 pitch. Started that swing a bit too early. Now that's a good changeup right there. You know the guy's sitting fastball. You get him out in front. Now that changeup's in his head the rest of the at bat. Swung on and missed. One and two now. From the belt, the pitch. Curve ball bounces and this one gets away. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. He's ready now. The pitch started to go around, but it's a called third strike. Here's D. Gordon now. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Leading off for the Mariners. Center fielder, D. Gordon. In there for strike one, 0 oh and one. The wind up and the 0 1. Swing and a line drive. That gets down and he's got himself a base hit. So the base hit puts the first man aboard to start the inning for the Mariners. Gene Segura standing in. He enters play hitting down in the 240s for the year. Segura. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Pitch is a cold strike. The throw way late, and he's in there easily at second. The 0 1 on its way. And a neck high fastball that time. For Gordon, stolen base number 16 so far. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. Fouled back. No one out with a runner at second.
Out in front of a fastball as this is ripped down the left field line. That's going to be a fair ball. And the run will score as the Mariners get off to a 1-0 lead. And he will pull into second with an RBI double. Next in at the plate is Ryan Healy. Ryan Healy. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Bautista has a read on it. He makes the catch and tagging is the runner from second. And the throw in gets away from him. So coming to the plate, Kyle Seeger. He's got that average way up into the 330s to begin the day. First pitch of the at bat. Check swing, but he held up in time. Ball one. Seeger will wait on the 1 0. And he misses again here. 2 0 to the Mariner third baseman. Boy, it sure doesn't seem like they want to pitch to this guy right here. I get that, but it's just the first inning. Sometimes you have to compete and set the tone. 3 and 0 now. He's set. Here's the 3 0. Chop foul wide of first. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with only one away. So striding forward now, Trey Mancini. It's been a rough go for him at the plate as he enters this one with a season average in the 230s. A fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one, one and oh. Matt, this is how you want to start a game. First inning, you already jump on them early. You get one run in, and now you have two other runners on base. You come up with a big hit here. You can really make a big dent right here in this game in the first inning. Well, you can see what he's trying to do right there. Double play situation. Two balls down in the zone trying to get that ground ball. Didn't get them to bite at either one. Now he's behind in the count, 2-0. and oh. Looks like a right-hander's got enough to throw now in the Oakland pen. And he misses again, ball four. And that's back to back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Digging in, Wilmer Flores. Given the situation, he's got an opportunity to break this game wide open. Gone! It's a grand slam. Striding into the box, Mitch Henniger. He's hitting just above the banner 300 mark on the season coming into this one. Now a check swing on the pitch inside, but he definitely broke the plane, and that's the first strike. Man, he's really struggling. He's laboring out there already. He's already given up a bunch of runs. Now, I know you have to go ahead. You don't want to get in that bullpen too early, but I'm just curious how long can the leash possibly be? And he takes one off the inside corner for ball two. To me, it looks like he just doesn't trust himself out there on the mound. It's like he's fighting his body on every pitch, and as a result, we're seeing a lot of balls from him early on in this game. Here it is on three and one. Boy, not close again. His third walk of the inning as that misses for ball four. Batting eight. That'll bring in Guillermo Heredia now. First shot for him here with a runner at first now and one away. Liner towards second, and that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. Here now is Mike Zanino. He begins playing this one with his batting average over the 310 plateau. And the changeup is way low that time. Well, Matt, the big thing I'm looking at is how many pitches he's already thrown here in the first inning. He's got a high pitch count. So if he continues like this, we're definitely going to see a bullpen game. Squared that one up just a little late. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Good changeup. Just missed inside. Great chance right here as a hitter to be aggressive. You can pretty much count on a pitcher. He's trying to get back in the strike zone. And with two guys on base right here, it's time to rip it and rip it. Trying to shave that outside corner with the fastball, and he missed it. It's 3-1 and one now. Ball hit high to the right side, but this will get into the seats foul. Well, he fouls off that fastball right there, and you wonder, does he love his fastball enough to come back with it three times in a row? Now here's a check swing, and they appeal down to first. No swing, so that's ball four. Center fielder Stepping in and ready for another D. shot, D. Gordon. Gordon. Second at-bat here. He reached via a single to lead off the home first. 
And they'll start things out with a change up here, but this is a bit too tight. It's ball one. Here it comes, 1-0. Oh. And this is on the ground to first. Could be two. Throw to second will be in time, but the run's going to come in and score. On to first, but not in time. He beats it out to keep the inning alive, and the run is in to score. Here comes the first pitch. Gene Segura will stand in for the second time now as he looks at a called strike. It's nothing in one. I like that take right there. I know it's a strike, but man, they're making him work. He's been struggling early, and now they're making him work even more. You got to stay within your game plan and be patient, and I think this is a good plan right now. Here comes the nothing in two pitch. Out into right center. Well hit. And the runner from third crosses the plate. Gordon rounds the corner and is headed home. And he will score as well. And they're really putting some distance between them now as that lead gets even bigger. Now batting. Striding in once play. again. Ryan Healy. Healy. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. And a slider gets away from him here as it just about got him in the ankle. Man, it's been a long inning. He's grinding through. Look, he's got an open base. And I, any other time, I'd say maybe pitch around him. But you can clearly see this inning's taking its toll on him right now. Hey, one thing's clear. He's not afraid to pitch inside, right? One pitch ducks him away. Then he comes right back with another one. So clearly this pitcher, he's not afraid to work that inner half of the plate. He's set. And the 2-1 pitch. And it misses three and one now. Kyle Seeger would be next. Hitters count all the way. Here it comes. Line to the right side. In is Batista, but this gets down a base hit. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. Make it nine nothing. Third base Digging in to try it again. Kyle Seeger trying to keep things going now with a runner at first following the RBI single. Sends that one out of play for strike one. A long inning as they've hung a nine spot on him to this point. Another one fouled off and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. This is just great pitching. They start him off with the slider to get the strike and then they bust him in with a fastball. I don't know what he's thinking up there but they really are messing with his mind right now. And here's a ball hit in the air. Mukroy is there to make the catch and mercifully. Outfielder Steven Piscotti the next to hit. And he is proving to be something of a non threat with a bat in his hands this year. The average isn't pretty. This is in the air to right. Waiting on it is Henniger. And that's the first out of the inning. Digging in, Jose right Batista. And you see that average below Jose the dreaded Batista. Mendoza line. Good swing, just got to try and straighten that one out. And this ball's heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0 and 2 now. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. This is line to left. Heredia is right there as he'll put it away without much problem for the second out. At the plate, Matt Olson. The average coming in just shy of 200. So maybe a hit or two in this ball game could push him at least over that dreaded mark. Line drive to center field. Gordon is there and they go down in a hurry here as his side is quickly retired. Digging in for his second at bat, Trey Mancini. No official at bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. Chris Bassett is going to come on in relief now, and he may be asked to eat several innings as this game is just still really getting underway. Chris Bassett. First pitch sinker misses in on the hands that time. It's a ball and no strikes. What good inside fastball right there. Trying to tie the hitter up, trying to keep him from getting those arms extended. A pitcher's pitch. And they won't get him to chase the curveball in the dirt that time, and it's 2 0 now. Now a check swing, but it's strike one anyway, says the home plate umpire. 
Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. And a good throw gets him one gun. At the plate, Wilmer Flores. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And here's a first pitch curveball that bounces on him there. It's ball one. Now the pitch. That's inside. 2 and 0. Well, not a great spot to be in right now. 2 and 0 to a great hitter like this. This is when you really have to pay attention as a pitcher. And if you have good off speed stuff, this might be the time to start mixing in your off speed stuff. Three and one now. And when you're already down by a bunch, this is where a guy's got to take some responsibility out there and at least start throwing some strikes. A high fastball is in there. Now that's not fair. You're supposed to be throwing sinkers, and he throws a high fastball right there. That's why everybody's shaking their head. Now here's a check swing, and they appeal down to first. No swing. So that's ball four. Ready for another chance? Mitch Henniger. He drew a walk his first time up. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. The 0 1. And he lays off for ball one. Here's the 1 1. Outside, 2 and 1. Runners on first with one down. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. That's in there, and it'll run the count to full three and two. I think it's a real possibility that they put that run on first in motion. That would help them stay out of that double play that would end the inning, but that's also kind of risky at the same time. Lowry. On to Hosmer, a double play, and the inning is over. In now, Jonathan Lucroy. Leading He'll start things Hopeless. out against James Jasper. Paxton as we Jonathan get the inning underway. Lucroy. Into the windup and the pitch. And he just misses with a curveball. Into his windup, here comes the 1-0. Now a ball hit sharply toward third. And there's the first hit of the game for the A's. The relay. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Set to get his evening at the plate started. Jed Lowry. And it's been a real struggle for him with the bat so far this year. Looking to get things turned around in a hurry. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Line toward center field. That's in there. Base hit. Lucroy is on his way home. And the run is in to score from second. It's now a 9 to 1 contest. Digging in now, Marcus Semyon. He was plunked with a pitch in his first trip to the plate. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. There's one. On to first. A double play. First baseman Eric Hosmer is in. 0 for 1 here in the early going. First pitch on its way. Smoked on the ground left side. And that's going to be a base hit here for Hosmer. And it keeps the inning alive for Chris Davis up next. Here's Chris Davis now. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Chris Davis. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Little dribbler down the line, but it gets foul. From the belt, the pitch. And this is fouled back and out of play. A runner on first with two away. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. That'll bring in Guillermo Heredia now. Off He'll lead things off as they look to perhaps Left build fielder. on an already Guillermo sizable lead. Heredia. Here's a first oh, pitch slider that just tails out of the zone. It's ball one. 
One and zero pitch on the way. Towards second. But there to take it is Lowry as he was well positioned for route number one. Catcher, Here now is Mike three. Zunino. Mike Zunino. Pitch on its way now to Zunino. And a fastball just a bit high. Bases are empty, one man out. And he falls behind now, 2 0. Swing and a liner, but foul. Into the windup, here's the 2 and 1 pitch. Just a bit low, ball three. One out, nobody on. And that swung on and fouled straight back. And he takes ball four. So a good job out of the nine hole in getting on base as we go back to the top of the order. Here's D. Gordon now. He's one for two in the ball game. And he'll try to hold back the swing, but he'll do so unsuccessfully as that's ruled a strike. And this is in the air down the left field line and into foul territory. And no one will track it down. Ready on 0 and 2. And here's a ball hit in the air. In there, a base hit. Ready for another shot now. Gene Segura. Bats here with a double and a triple on his line in this round. First pitch on its way. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1 0. Ready with the 1 0 pitch. And I believe he broke the plane of the plate there. He most certainly did. It's a ball and a strike. Getting a few steps off a second there. Now the pitch. Late on the fastball there as this one skied out toward right. Bautista will drift over to his left a few steps as he takes it for the second out. And he'll take those extra 90 feet. So put runners at the corners now with two gone in the inning. Now batting. Digging in and Earth looking for more. Left. Ryan, Ryan Healy. Two Healy. on, two out for him here in the third. Looking to wiggle out of this. Here it is. Pitch is a ball. And here's the tag, and he is dead in the water trying to steal. Coming to the plate now, Matt Chapman. Leading He's 0 for 1 thus far. Third baseman, Matt the pitch. Chapman. And that one's in on the hands to start the inning. It's ball one. Here's the pitch. And this is pulled foul as he was way out in front there. He hit that change up hard. Man, he saw it good. Just wasn't able to keep it fair. I'll straighten him up there on that fastball. It's one and two now. Well, as demonstrated there, that's a tough pitch to do anything with. <laughs> yeah, good luck. But hey, a high fastball all of a sudden becomes really dangerous for a pitcher if it's not spotted above the zone. A little height difference makes all the difference. I like the pitch right there. Two strike fastball out of the zone. See if he'll chase. I'd go even further out this time. See if he chases it again. I like the pitch right there. Got him to chase a fastball out of the zone. I'd come back with it again. And this is swung on and missed in this fourth inning. We'll start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout. And there's one away. Stephen Piscotti. Into the windup and the pitch. Fooled him a bit as this is hit high in the air towards right center and shallow. Hanniger has a long run, but he takes charge for route number two. The right fielder number nine. Here comes the right fielder, Jose, Jose Batista. Batista. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And a fastball just below the knees, ball one. Two outs, base is empty, and I got one of my power guys at the plate. This is where you let it fly right here. Give me a home run or a double. Give me some kind of extra base hit here. 
And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2 0. Hitters count. Here's the 2 0 pitch. Sent on the ground, but right into the shift. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. Digging in once again, Ryan Healy. He's singled and two trips to the Kurt plate Bateman. thus far. Ryan Healy. Lifted in the air out to right. Bautista has a read on it. One down. Here's third the third baseman, baseman now, 15. Kyle Seeger. 0 for 1 with a run Seager. scored thus far. And a good idea to hold off on that swing. It's ball one. The windup and the 1 0 pitch. Checks his swing here, but he does so in time. Not sure what he saw in that pitch, but it sure looked tempting. And at least he held up. He must have been guessing. And he'll lay the fastball in here to get the count back to two and one. Right-hander starts to loosen out in the bullpen now. Into the windup. Here's the two and one pitch. He's fallen behind now. Three and one. And this is going to be a foul ball. Oh, and he lets him off the hook there as this isn't even close for ball four. Up next for so Seattle. striding in, Designated Trey Mancini. Hitter. 0 for Trey 1 for him here in this one. Here's oh, a first a pitch slider that just tails out of the zone. It's ball one. I'll tell you, it's a helpless feeling for a manager or a pitching coach when your pitchers are having a really hard time hey. throwing strikes. What are you supposed to do well, other well. than keep trying new guys until someone starts attacking the zone? Ready with the 1 1 pitch. Heavy okay. sinker just stayed inside. Well, when you're behind an account like this pitcher is, it's a good time to work in something off speed if you're confident in it. Most hitters are looking for fastball. And he missed again, high and away this time. Three and one. Three and one, here it is. And look out, that's in very tight, and it's ball four. Ready once well, again, Wilmer four, Flores. He launched one over the Wilmer. wall back in the opening Five. frame. Now a 58-foot curveball that misses for a ball. Seems like he's just lost the strike zone these last several pitches. He's got a walk, and that pitch right there, that wasn't even close. Hit back up the middle. And he is out at second base. Standing in, Mitch Hanniger. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Swung on and grounded foul. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Sliced hard but foul. Look out over there. Grounded to third. Fielded cleanly. Throw on to first. He'll be in time and the Mariner rally gets turned away. Stepping in, Matt Olson. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Here's the first pitch to him. The knee buckler, and he swings and misses at it. I like that he used the curveball to get ahead there. That's a tough pitch to hit in this lefty-lefty matchup. So if you can get it over the plate on the first pitch, it can be pretty effective. Into the windup, here comes the 0-2 pitch. And another foul ball. Another 0-2 coming. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. Stepping into the Up box, Jonathan Lucroy. He scored a run Jonathan after stroking a Lucroy. double in his first at-bat.
Pitch swung on and hit in the air. Gordon giving chase. But he can't make the play as it finds the outfield grass. Oh, and he throws it away. Digging in the switch hitter, the Jed Lowry. Lowry. Looking to follow up the RBI single Jed from his first at-bat. Down the first baseline. Segura for one. On to first. Not in time as the umpire was right there to make the call. The batter, number 10. Stepping up to the Short plate, stop. Marcus Semien comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Breaking ball that's cut on and missed for the first strike. Well, he's really having good success in this game. And, you know, looking at it, you go, how's he doing it? Well, it's surely not the first pitch strike. I mean, he's a little over 60% first pitch strikes. That's good. It's not great for the type of success. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away. Stepping into the box, Guillermo Heredia, one for two on his line so far in the game. Santiago Casilla gets the call to pitch here, and he'll try to sort this mess out. He's going to try to at least eat a couple of innings for his guys. Santiago Casilla. Hit on the ground to third. Chapman comes up with it, and on one pitch, he's retired. Coming to the plate now, Mike Zanino. A couple of walks for him thus far. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Takes a look at a slider that catches the inside corner. Pitch on its way now to Zanino. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. Here's the one and one pitch. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. One and two. One and two. Here it comes. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there. Two away. Into the box now. D. Gordon is looking for hit number three here in this at bat. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Ready for another shot now. Eric Hosmer. He's one for two in the ball game. Eric Hosmer. Into the windup and the pitch. Now this ball popped up. Playable, however, behind the plate for Zanino. And he'll stay with it here as he puts the squeeze on it for out number one. Number two. Digging in to try it again. Chris Davis. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ball game. Now a swing and a miss as they start him out on a pitch well inside for strike one. Boy, not a good swing there. That was really ugly. Anytime you can make a hitter look like that, you've done something special. Uh, did it look to you like he was guessing on the pitch? Oh, certainly it had to be, Matt. But if he was, he obviously wasn't looking for that pitch. Fly ball out toward left center field. Gordon is after it, and he tracks it down. A nice running play to record the second out. How about him? Stepping in and ready Matt for another shot. Chapman. Matt Chapman, 0 for 2 with a couple of strikeouts for him so far. The knee buckler, and he swings and misses at it. The wind up and the 0-1. A swing and a miss at the big curveball. He is being aggressive in this inning. 0-2 on this hitter. The first two outs were recorded quick because he came right after the hitter. I don't think that changes right now either. He's going to continue to be aggressive to this hitter as well. Pretty standard fastball right there, 0-2. Now he's changed. Uh, and he runs out of gas between base. Gene Segura standing in. The bats here with a double and a triple on his line in this one. The shortstop. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Back up the middle. And that's in there for a base hit. His third hit of the game. So the leadoff hitter reaches base safely. And now it's the run-producing part of the order with nobody out. Ready for another chance? Ryan Healy. It was a fly-out for him in his last trip. And a good slider here to start the at-bat. But it's ruled a ball. 1-0. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. Bautista looks up. Gone! 
Here's the third baseman now, Kyle Seeger. A couple of walks for him thus far. 15, Kyle Seeger. First pitch coming. Here it is. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. Boy, they have just not pitched well at all in this game. I mean, anytime you give up double ditches, the pitching coach starts looking over his shoulders like, hey, hey, my fault. And here's a curveball in the dirt that time for a ball. One and one. Now the pitch. And that's taken for a cold strike two. No outs, nobody on. Popped high in the air. Chapman is there for it. One away. Riding in once again, Trey Mancini. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Hit down the third baseline. Backhanded. On to first, and there were two down. Digging in once again, Wilmer Flores. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. In tight here with the first pitch fastball that's 1 and 0. Casillas ready. 1 0 on its way. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And that'll get by and on through towards the wall. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. Up next, ready Steve once Evans. again. Mitch right Henniger. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. From the stretch. Hit weakly back to the mound. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Into the box now, Stephen Piscotti. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. And he misses inside with that one, ball one. Two and oh now. From the wind up, the 2 0 pitch. Mm, pretty good cut there, but it's to two and one now. I'll tell you, we're in the later stages of this ball game, but his fastball is still coming out of his hand with plenty on it. Now a ball fouled down the right field line out of play, so that'll move the count to two and two now. Ooh, that was a good pitch to hit. He wants that one back. He was just a little bit late on it. Here's a swing and a ground ball. Ready with another 2-2. Two -two. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. Here comes the right fielder, Jose Batista. Right he started out the evening 0 for 2 so Jose far. Bautista. Swing and a miss as he was way in front of that one. The wind up and the 0 1. Outside, nope, outside for a ball, 1 and 1. And he'll stay alive here as this is chopped foul at the plate. It'll remain 1 and 2. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the 1 2. Again, he sends it out of play. Another 1 2 delivery. The shift will be of little importance here as this is lifted in the air out to left field. Heredia is there and he'll bring this one in. Now so striding forward now, hitter. Matt Olson. Matt He's 0 for 2 Olson. with a strikeout in this one. Fouled straight back. The 0 1 on its way. This is swung on and lifted down the left field line, but it'll get back into the crowd as he jumps ahead of him now, 0 and 2. I think a big reason why he's been so effective in this one that he's been just about getting. And we'll have to leave it there as this is. That'll bring in Guillermo Heredia now. He'll start things out here in the bottom of inning number seven. Guillermo Heredia. Action in the bullpen now as a right-hander begins to throw out there. 
from the stretch. Here's the pitch. Look out as this bat shatters on impact. Throw and he's called out on a close play at first. Now with the plate, Mike, Mike Sonino. A couple of walks Mike for him thus Zunino. far. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Knee high slider that he takes a look at. Pitch on its way now to Zanino. This is in the air out to straightaway center. Piscotti's there for it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Ready now, D. Gordon. On the night, he's two for four with a pair of singles. Slow grounder to first. On with it to first is Hosmer, and that ends the inning. In is the catcher, Jonathan Lucroy. He doubled earlier and carries a two-for-two two line into Jonathan this appearance. Lucroy. Into the windup and the pitch. And he swings on top of one here and chops it foul right at home plate. Hot shot on the ground is short. Segura has it. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. Here's Jed Lowry now. A Jen hit in two Lowry. tries so far. First delivery to him on the way. Fastball and he swings through it to fall behind. He's been getting ahead in the count all game long. I think the key has been working off his fastball. Grounder down the line at third. But this will get foul for strike two. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. A swing and it's popped in the air back behind first. Healy takes charge out there and he stays with it for the second out. So now stepping in, Marcus Georgia. Semyon. He comes Marcus. in 0 for 2 thus Semyon. far. Here's the first pitch to him. Well hit the other way and it's into the gap. He's around first heading for two. And they're going to hold him to a single here as they do a nice job of getting it back in quickly. Striding into the box, Eric Hosmer. His last at bat didn't go his way as he popped out in foul territory. And he gets ahead 0 and 1. Well, that's another first pitch strike right there. Now he's over 70% so far in this game. First pitch strike to hitters. That's why he's deep in the game right now. And this is fouled back and out of play. One run, five hits, and no errors in the ballgame for the A's so far. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout. Gene Segura standing in, and he'll complete the cycle if he can blast one over the wall here. Liam Hendricks enters now in a mop-up role as he'll try to keep the deficit right where it is. Pitching for the Athletics, number 31. Now a check swing, but he holds up in time. Ball one. The windup and the 1-0 pitch. Now a swing and a ball chopped foul right at home plate. Here it comes on one and one. A fastball that just misses inside. As long as you actually get it inside, that two-seam fastball running towards the hands is a really good pitch. He goes the other way as this is hit in the air toward the gap in right center. Under it is Bautista as he makes the play for route number one. Next for Seattle. Digging in and looking for more, Ryan Healy. He went deep earlier and he's two for four to this point. Now a swing and a miss. Took something off that one and it's strike one. Curveball, swing and a miss, and he's behind in the count 0 and 2. The windup and the 0 2 pitch. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. So coming to the plate, Kyle Seeger. He's 0 for 2 with a couple of walks in this one. And they'll try and get him out in front to start the at bat, but this misses off the plate away. It's ball one. He's already got two walks in this game, and that ball right there, uh, another ball. So we may see them kind of nibbling and pitching around him. He might be taking walks all game. Down low, and the clock thickens here, 3 and 0. Oh. And he takes ball four again, and they clearly just don't want any part of him in this one. 
So digging in now, Trey Mancini. He's 0 for 2 thus far in this one. Scooped up. And as it turns out, the two out walk doesn't come around to home. Here's Chris Davis now. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. The left fielder, number two, Chris Davis. Here's a high pop up. Healy is there for it. Makes the play, one away. Stepping into the box, Matt Chapman. Three at bats for him in this one, all ending with him going down on strikes. Now a ball pulled hard but fouled off to the left. This is flared out towards second. On to first, and now the A's are down to their final out. Center Outfielder field Steven Piscotti the next to hit. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. This ball's grounded foul. The wind up and the 0 1. The short hit hard. And that gets through, so he'll have his first base hit and make him 1 for 4 in the game now. And that'll extend the inning and give Jose Bautista a chance as well. Fielder number 19. Into the box Austin now, Bautista. Jose Batista. He flew out in his last at bat. And here's a ball hit in the air. Zunino is under it, makes the catch, and that's the ball game. And they did some damage offensively in this one, enough to get the win, and this man led the charge. He's our tops player of the game. Hey, he wound up with three hits, triple, a double, a single, very close to the cycle, but he wasn't able to lose one over the fence. Still a great game at the plate, though. Our final line score tonight, first for the victorious 